All right, so someone asked me about how to create the uh, attendance QR code. So I, th I, I thought it might be easier if I just put this in a video. Rick, I hope this helps you. Um, so what I did was I went in to my Google account, to my drive, um, and then I hit new. And the minute you do that, it says spreadsheet. So I went ahead and created that. And I'm, I'm using what I've already made. Um, so this will be uh, for an event that's happening um, uh, then as soon as inaugural week starts, this will be during inaugural week. So anyway, uh, so I made this uh, this Google spreadsheet. I gave it a title. That's the only thing I did on here. You already already see this, but remember I've already created it. So I just put the title in. Then I hit tools and I say create a form. The minute that happens, this form it gives me a blank form, and as you can see, I've already started uh, filling it out uh, for the questions that I have linked to the spreadsheet. All right, so the minute that that is done, then I can go over, and let me see if I can pull this bar over so we can uh, see what I've done from there. Yeah, here we go. Um, so once I've got this like I wanted, this uh, the Google form, then I push send, and the minute that happens, you have a, a space up here where it's got a link, and I always say shorten the link. Um, and and it used, there it goes. I'm having a little bit delay, and there it shortens it, and then I can just copy it. All right, once I get that copied, that link copied, I can then go over to a QR code uh, uh, generator, and I, I put the link in there uh, in the email for you, Rick. Um, but let me move this up so you can see just in case. It's www.qr-code-generator.com. But anyway, you'll come to this. You lay that Google form URL that you just copied off the form right in there and you hit create a QR code and immediately um, this will it will create a QR code for you so it'll be right here on the right and then what I do from there um, is I actually take the snipping tool which is, is on all computers and you can see I've already been using it so um, if, if you do that um, and I'm going to say new and then I'm just going to lay that right in over top of that, snip that out, and you see immediately I have the QR code. Um, then I can actually um, I can actually save it, save as, put it somewhere, and then after that, all I have to do is just show the QR code. When you zap it, it'll take you to the form. Now I'm not sure where this one will take you, so I'd rather you not uh, go on this one and actually answer my questions because I think this is actually to the flash mob that I'm going to be doing. So if you could just don't, don't, but it will take you somewhere. Um, just giving you an example of what to do. Okay, so I hope this helps. Uh, let me know if we can do anything else.